The battle continues over the handling of a troubled Milwaukee police officer. The mayor and police chief butting heads over how to handle his employment moving forward. Our Suzanne Spencer joins us live downtown now with why the two disagree here. Officer Mattioli is accused of killing a man and obviously very serious allegations. Now, depending on what happens with his criminal case, his internal one here at City Hall inside the Fire and Police Commission could come into play. An unprecedented move is going down quietly in an empty city hall. On Tuesday, the Fire and Police Commission demanding to take over the internal investigation into Officer Michael Mattioli, accused in the death of Joel Acevedo. Since then, Milwaukee's mayor and police chief are in a battle of words over Mattioli's employment. The mayor writing his employment must be terminated and would stop the taxpayers from having to pay a salary to an individual charged with first degree reckless homicide. Do you think that that's a fair ask of the mayor to the chief? No, I don't think it's a fair ask. I think it's a response to public pressure and not uh, the mayor's not showing his understanding of the internal workings of the Milwaukee Police Department. The chief already handed internal documents over to the FPC, saying, I no longer had the authority to render any discipline, including discharge of police officer Mattioli. Criminal defense attorney Russell Jones says no officer should be fired without due process and could open the city up for legal disputes. Just because he's been charged with a crime doesn't mean he's guilty of it, number one. And number two, there may be policies and procedures that he violated, even though he was off duty, he still is subject to those policies and procedures. The Milwaukee Police Association has questioned if the FPC investigators have enough experience to conduct this unprecedented move. The way that they did it suggests to me that they're, they're showing a lack of trust in the police department, which is unfortunate. And Officer Mattioli remains on a paid suspended leave at this point. Now, while the chief says the discipline lies with the FPC, a member associated with the FPC tells us typically the chief handles that sort of discipline. We're kind of charting into uncharted waters, so to speak. So lots of this could still change. Reporting live in downtown Milwaukee, Suzanne Spencer, Fox 6 News. We'll follow up as it does. All right, Suzanne, thank you.